Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Cool Site. In this video, we will describe how we can do COVID test at home. Nowadays, it is very dangerous to go to testing centers and getting tested because the TPR rate is very high. So, for the, if you have some symptoms and feel like you have a COVID and if you don't have any official requirement of a test result, then we can buy this COVID kit and we can test ourselves. Suppose if you have some symptoms, it is always advised to take the test and get it confirmed about COVID. Here I have bought this COVID cell from my lab, which is available in local medical store without any prescription for a price of rupees, 250 rupees. And you, when you buy this, please see that you have a valid expiry date. And uh, after this, we have to install the Kobe Self app from Play Store on your mobile. And uh, as usual, you have to key in some details like name, uh, Aadhaar number and other things to make it active. And uh, be sure to give uh, all the permissions required because here we have to scan and take photo and other things. So uh, permissions for camera and all are needed. Okay, after once you register, you can log in using your username and password. Then you have to press on new test. And after pressing the new test, uh, a new tab will ask you whether you need a self test or for a relative. We look into the kit. We have a pamphlet telling the details how to do the test and we have a veil having a liquid in it which is a testing liquid and also have a cartridge and there is a swab for taking the sample. And again uh, when you start the app you have to uh, in the app itself they have clearly mentioned uh, how to do the test. We have all the, it is very detailedly described in the app itself. Again, you have to key in some details like uh, you, whether you have, when you have taken the vaccination, uh, which vaccine you have to take, you have taken, whether you have symptomatic, and these details you need to key in. And uh, you need to scan your uh, the cartridge. There is a QR code on the cartridge. You need to scan it to get the QR code connected to the, the your test test connected to the app. Here, as I told you, you have to key in the details. Then it will again show you how you have to do the test. And uh, look at. Uh, Look at the testing wheel having the liquid. Before you do the test, you have to do uh, sanitize your hand, and you need to tap the liquid four or five times on your table, on a table or any flat surface to make the liquid uh, liquid uh, active. And this is showing the procedure. We have the swab. And this, those who have done the COVID test before in labs and all know how to take this up. You have to insert it in your nose as deep as possible and take a small one or two turns and get the swab on the strip. And after getting the swab, you have to insert it into the liquid and mix it well. And you have to drop one or two drops to the testing cartridge. I will show you how we have done it. Here you can see there, are, there is a swab, the rod type thing and the testing wheel that is uh, having the liquid and the pamphlet and the cartridge. You take out the testing swab, insert it into your nose and make one or two twists and uh, open the liquid and insert the swab into the liquid and uh, at least 10 times you shake or rotate it. Then there is a point where you can uh, uh, bend it and you can tear it and keep the swab inside and you see the cap there is a hole. Through this hole we need to drop the liquid to the testing cartridge. You close it and you have to turn upside down and uh, put two drops onto the 
cartridge. As I have shown, then immediately you have to start the timer and timer start from 15 minutes. Here I have, put, I have already put the liquid to the uh, cartridge and it is moving and the counter, uh, the timer is running. And there are two marks on the cartridge, one is T and the other one is C. T is for test and C is for control. If we get a line at T, that means you are positive and if you get only a line at C, means you are negative. Okay, then you have to face your uh, test cartridge after 15 minutes towards the app and the app will uh, read the, your value and app, you know, this is bit time bit tricky because it will take some time to read it properly you can see it, it is uh, i am having a, a mark at a t that means this test is considered it will be positive definitely it is trying to grab the uh, reading yeah now it has uh, already taken the reading then you need to scan it uh, your qr code once again to get the, it validated with your testing cartridge and uh, now the result will come you see the result inside this red circle it is showing antigen positive that means the test result is positive if you need a detailed report there is a one tab in the bottom if you press on it you will get your uh, result like this here your details will come in the top portion here i have masked it and as per the, the them uh, if you get a positive result it is confirmed and no need for any further test unless you have needed any for an official purpose and i will show an example of negative result also here you can see it is that the mark has come against the c that means it is the t is neg uh, negative that means you don't this uh, negative result when you show it and scan it the result that this result is negative suppose by any case if you cannot do on app and register on app or if you need not want to register on app you can do it like the same manner what i have shown and if you just self you can see it if there is a mark against t means uh, you are positive and there is no mark at t and only at c that means you are negative hope you understood uh, the process it is very simple just for 250 rupees you can do it at home if you like the video please uh, pass it to your friends and let them be also be informed about this